All right, we're going to do the top 10 in 10. It'll be 10 minutes. Going to go over 10 interesting sales over the last week. Some of this stuff will be hot stuff. Some might be cold, but it's mostly interesting sales. Uh, and I'm going to start the clock once I find it. Right now. All right, so as we usually start off with, I'm going to start off the top 10 in 10 with the big ticket items. And the first one is Groot. <sighs> Tales to Astonish, 13. A 7.5. 16,500 dollars. Wow. People love trees. Groot is back, baby. <laughs> Holy shit. I know that's crazy. It's a seven and a half. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> and just to give you a sense, here, here's some of them for a seven and a half. Uh there's the sixteen thousand five hundred uh, in June on June twentieth. It sold for ten thousand five hundred. Back in March, it sold for eight thousand dollars, and then earlier in March, it sold for <laughs> four thousand nine hundred and twenty dollars. And this so is like not is even like the Groot that's in the movie because this Groot taught. Okay, cool. Yeah, well, we're getting the the Groot series soon, right? The little shorts. Yeah, maybe mm -hmm. people are getting excited. I don't know if I'm getting sixteen thousand dollars excited, mm -hmm. but hey, it's not my money. I wanted to put some. I mean, at his here. height, though, this is the weirdest shit. Like at the height, this didn't sell anywhere close to this. Mm -hmm. I mean, well, there was one that was close because that's why I didn't say all time high for this one because there was a, or like years ago, it got kind of close. But I they wanted to put some like an books, offer on it. They like... didn't hit highs. This, however, oh. is a Hulk one eighty one nine six, three sigs, Stanley Herb Trimp, and uh, I can't think of the name. Ledwin. Yes. Ledwin. Yeah. Eighty thousand uh, dollars. But this wait a minute. For, best offer on fifty thousand. They took forty five thousand dollars. Wow. Forty five thousand dollars. That's some. That's that's an interesting way to get cigs for CGC. Uh, oh, sorry. That's old. Don't forget the thirteen thousand. That should have been deleted. But apparently, I left it in there. But you can see the idea of the, the nine six signature series. Granted, they don't have the same cigs, but just to give you a sense. 15,000, 20,000, 16,000. And these are 2020, 2019 sales. So that's quite a jump to go to 45 off of 15 mm -hmm. for the last sale. Regardless of who signed it and how many signatures, that's a lot of money, if you ask me. Yeah. But moving on, last week's one to watch, this G.I. Joe book. Oh, uh, I need to get that book. I missed it. The R.I. I did order it. I only ordered one. I usually order two of things, but for whatever reason... I only ordered one, and I probably should have ordered two because it's actually, it's held. There's only been about a dozen sales, which is not a ton, but it's held that fifty dollar kind of price point for a one in ten. It's a beautiful hmm. book. That's nice. So for a one in ten, that's not. That's bad. really good. Yeah, especially for a week over. Yeah. Uh, another book I was white. selling last week. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The Sig, book. The sigs on the the sigs on that cover and getting all three of those guys. That seemed pretty sketch, but whatever. Yeah. First, Stacy Banks. If you're an Archie collector, here we go. We got a first character appearance in the Summer Surf Party, Friends Forever, Betty and Veronica number one. This is a regular $3 cover. This is not a store exclusive. This is just a regular book for this special for the summer. And well, maybe uh, they resubmitted it. Yeah, it's like 15 to 20 bucks. Which, so if you can go grab this out of your shop, go ahead and grab it because 15 to 20 bucks for a first appearance can't go wrong. <laughs> We mentioned 8 Billion Genies earlier and joked about optioning it. And yes, issue one heated up and started selling 15, 20 bucks. Last week, I told you about issue two getting hot and selling for 15 to $25, what have you. Well, guess what? Issue three came out last week. And can you guess what it's selling for? 15, 15 to 20 dollars. <laughs> there you go. So this Jeez, is like a $20. But, and you can see there's plenty of sales. Good. Keep buying that Michigan greatness. That's right. Yeah. Everybody wish they lived here. So, no, they don't. Okay, look at this shit. If you can find one. You tell me you why go. number three sell it then, because they just want to be part of it. Yeah, don't think this is going to take for number four. That's yes, like it will. FOC. Five, six, seven, eight, no, and nine, it's ten. Gonna die. There's gonna be plenty of copies. <laughs> but here we go. A Halloween I'm comic fest, and not unlike free comic book day. These were free books that are given out at Halloween time. This I Ayanu, I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, this has been greenlit at HBO Max, not optioned. It's produced production making yeah. it made it's yeah. coming out so there is a series an animated series so. for this comic whatever this ayanu i don't know much about it but this free book is 30 bucks basically 125 bucks for a lot of five 
And then, like I said, the regulars you can see like 30 bucks. So dig in those dollar bins. You might find this free book for cheap and it's selling. Zeggy and amount. me. Stop saying you. You and me. We are the only two people reading that book. <laughs> you and me. Uh, well, yeah, we're moving through this list pretty quick. It's going to be less than 10 minutes, I think, because the next couple of books, I got to thank my buddy Van Denby, who's also a writer over at CBSI, because he pointed out some random sales in our chat. And I was like, you know what? These are actually interesting sales. Booster Gold, number one. <sighs> A nine eight sold That's for five hundred and ninety dollars yeah. at auction. It's a Canadian. I granted this is a Canadian price. Dude, variant, if Patrick, weird, if, if, if 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 eight billion genies is paying your rent, you got some cheap rent, bro. <laughs> <laughs> eight billion. Genies. Well, Booster Gold could be paying your your rent. Booster Gold might be paying part of your rent. Variants. I want Patrick's rent. I mean, I this don't is have the price demons. bump because if you look, just nine eights of this book have sold for like three fifty, three hundred, two fifty. 400 this is all june these are all june sales multiple june sales mm -hmm. in that 300 dollar range so to jump to 590 just because it's a canadian price variant mm. i don't know i don't spend money on that kind of stuff but if you do god bless you hopefully you get your return see this is like that's a good book to dig too but just regular yeah regular booster gold but this is gonna be a tougher one for you fine but this is a one in 50 this is amazing spider-man renew your vows it's j scott campbell i'm a fan uh and this is not an easy one to find if you go looking right now raw copies are like 300 350 uh for this one right now and just this week 682 dollars and 75 cents one sold for uh actually two days wow. ago and that is from what i can tell an all-time high for this book in 98 because before it was 400 300 200 <laughs> so 682 seems to, to be a new watermark sell it sell, sell it if you got it i mean it's not gonna be easy to find it. for one at 50 it's secret wars not everybody loved all these mini series from mm -hmm. secret wars so if you got them go ahead and make that money if you can whoa black adam I love this cover. I do like this Alex Ross cover. I do not have it. Kind of wish I did. And it's a one in 10, which is not a high ratio incentive, but $735 is a significant, significant increase over where it's been these last couple of months. Maybe people are getting excited for this movie. I don't know. Maybe it's a new series, but considering he just died, limit our expectations. But that said, 735 a couple of days ago. Before that, it was 440. It was 500. Best offer on 600. You can limit your expectations all you want. I think this is going to be it, dude. Yeah, this, this is, is DC's a, MCU a movie, right? Out there. Right. Yeah, there's a lot of nine eights. I don't know, but I like it. It's just that's that's a hefty price for a nine eight on a one in ten. 735. <coughs> but it's your money. Spend it how you like it. Uh, I was going to try to cover a couple of books this oh, week. Patrick. I thought about the Garbage Pail Kids Mad Balls books. I thought about the Aliens Delato, which is kind of cool. I do like that cover. I thought about that Star Wars Maleev, the one in 50 for Vader 25. That's also a cool cover, but yeah. none of them really jumped as much as the Catwoman, uh, Sozo Mica, Catwoman mm. 45, the one in 25. This is new this week. Uh, and much like her other one in 25s, this, a watch. Why are we surprised? Yeah. It, she's, not she's, not, she's, she's not getting as high prices as she used to. On the... 150, yeah, it's not hitting the highs, but not hitting the I did see anymore. this. I didn't like this one personally. The noise was a little too uh, too sharp, a little too pointy. Mm. I don't know. The Im like the preview image didn't give you the whole filigree of the background <laughs> with the framework or the jewels, as Marco pointed out. She loves doing yeah. the jewels. She does, I mean, it's like her main thing now, which is kind of cool. Yeah, those weren't shown mm -hmm. in the preview image when you had to pre-order this like a month or two ago. But so I she also has an art book premiering at San Diego, and she's going to have a Chrome uh, of the Harley Quinn. If you like, but we stuff. actually ended early. Nice. I so forgot. Patrick stop Wright. a timer. Patrick so could be that cheap. I forgot he lives in Ohio. Look, I forgot he lives in Ohio. They found you a girl. Yeah. Did they? they found you a girl. There you go. Hey, I found me something, huh? All right, Iverson. Good stuff. Do we have overtime? 
we do have overtime because I did prepare this because we were talking about Sozo Micah. We've talked about her before. Marco, you got to talk to her. You thought she's still going to be a superstar, and she kind of is. I mean, you look at these prices. Not kind of. She's still a superstar. Out. She's doing better than anybody else right now. Exactly. So I, I thought, you know what? Let's take a look to see how her last books are still doing. So this was the last issue, the one in 25. Everybody was jumping on it. Cat it's still doing 85 to 90 bucks. Like, it's still doing well. Maybe not as well as it was at first, but still doing well. Same thing with the issue before, 43. Uh, this is the Polaroid one with her and Harley Quinn. Mm -hmm. This one, it hit like highs of what, like three over three hundred dollars at Bill times. Sold. Yeah, Bill sold for her signed at MCC. I think it was uh three twenty five. Yeah, it's not there, but it's still a solid hundred, hundred thirty five, hundred bucks. It's not ratio, which is one in twenty five. So it's still not a ratio book. I do have this one. I don't mm -hmm. have the other two. But mm. it is what it is. Uh, she's still uh, churning out the hits, I guess. People are still buying them. The money is still flowing. So if you can yeah. get them, make that money. So yeah. until next week, yeah. that was our top 10 in 10. I, Mark, I think it's because like she's, I mean, she is the rock star of, of, of artists right now. Who knows how long she'll hold on to it. I think it's going to be a while. 